Peace, How's it going? What's up, guys? So, um, I didn't plan on filming any of this, but like a week ago to the day almost, um, me and David went and picked up a cheap Harbor Freight, like the Predator series, like Honda Clone Motors. Um, because David's had this go kart frame laying around for the longest um, with a motor that was no good on it. And, uh, well, we finally went and bought that. They were on sale for like a hundred bucks for the six and a half horsepower uh, Honda clone Predator Briggs and Stratton clone bullshit copycat thing. So we went and picked one up and put it together. And then Tractor Supply had us a clutch. So we put it together. A uh, little Honda clone. Like I said, uh, Tractor Supply clutch, factory chain and sprocket set up. This redneck ingenuity so far as to run the throttle cable that it was broken originally anyway and well needless to say we it, it works really well well then there's another one because we got to thinking well if we have one go-kart let's go buy another go-kart so we literally just got it home out of the back of the Accord wagon yes it fit and Barely. This one, hey puppy. Look at the puppy. Look at the big puppy. This one has a three and a half horsepower uh, Tecumseh engine. Look at the jaws on you. Good God. Cut through a rebar with them bastards. So, anyway, this one's got a three and a half horsepower um, Tecumseh, which I absolutely despise Tecumseh motors in every way, shape, and form. But for the 90 bucks we've got in it, fuck it. So, it's obviously some type of severely homemade go-kart, but it holds together. I'm gonna have to weld another X in the back to support the frame, because yes, that motor is flexing, and with weight on it, it's even worse. It snapped before the guy said they welded it, and JV welded it on top of the welds to try to hold it. It should be fine. We'll see. So the three and a half horse Tecumseh with a worn out clutch and a open diff, which is what this has. It's a one wheel peel. And that one with the six and a half with a live axle, which is freaking killer. And I guess that's it. This, this is what we got going on. So now we have to find a couple more. We need more. You can't just have two. We need about seven. The clutch on that one's pretty weak. However, David's is just ready to take off and sling it around. Hey David, sling it through the yard. Uh -huh. So sling it around in the yard down here. How far down? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, go. Yeah, so, like I said, that one is just a little torque monster with its live axle on six and a half, and it still has a governor on it. We haven't even bypassed the governor yet. So that one's a little bit of weak sauce. This one wheel. That's bad. Yeah, we have got to fix that one. Hey, go. Hey.
So yeah. Go-kart adventures is apparently the next thing we're also working on. So um, I am really bad about getting more projects than we can finish. For example, the automatic EF hatchback we still have. Um, the Baja Honda hatchback that I am supposed to jump for y'all because of the thousand subscriber challenge. I am going to jump it, please. I know it's been like two months since we uh, brought that challenge up, but we're gonna jump it. There's The frame is bent underneath the car, and so I have to get fully adjustable suspension uh, with control arms and everything to adjust the wheel tilt so that we can get it all aligned enough. So that we can drive it fast enough in a straight line to jump it. I promise it is coming. Um, the Honda Accord wagon still needs a transmission or work done to the transmission. The EG Coupe is still Jesse's daily with some issues. And the automatic Mustang has only been on here once in a cold start. It's still here, still running. There's just so much I haven't gotten around to. And like the Geo that we just bought, the, the Storm. Well, we just keep adding more. Now there's go-karts we want to work on. So there's just going to be a lot of updates for a lot of different stuff. So you just have to bear with us until we sort through everything. Steven, he's got his work clothes on. <laughs> oh, these work? Well, what happened? I don't know. Yeah, mug That's bottom. a mud <laughs> I, uh, I can tell. Y'all are colorful. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That thing, I drifted around the village a little bit. Damn, I have. Me too, until, you know, I got stuck I'm there. about to hit the building. Well. It slid perfect between the Jeep and the EM, though. <laughs> I know. Mine went, I went around and then back around the other car on it and around the trailer. And this then is too low. Well, we'll, we'll deal with it in due time. Well, I guess you're going to ride this one? I don't know. We'll yeah, figure something out. So. Okay, I'm going to go change and go to work. I'm yeah, go-karts. I'm about to do some fucking donuts. I hear you. Guess what's up there? Which one? Okay. Hate to compasses. Freaking hate to compasses. Oh. oh, it's all muddy now. Thanks, Jesse. So, now that all the mud from the wheels has been thrown all over me, uh, yeah, it works. Uh, not quite the fastest. Like I said, I hate to comp so I'm probably just gonna ungovern it and let this thing rev until it blows. Um, this is so weak, this is not okay. Um, I'm gonna definitely have to weld some type of beam in there. Um, this tire is shot. So, we'll have to get in. Holy oh, Jesse, he's in that mud. So, hi, buddy. So, good girl. Anyway, go-karts guys, we're doing go-karts right now. We're on our go-kart fix. So as long as we're on our go-kart fix, uh, yeah, you're gonna see go-kart shit. Yeah, we need another one of these, or the twin. I did not realize how fast so. the twin thing was. 
All right. That well, way you can turn. We're at 10 minutes now. They've seen the go kart spin out. They've seen them drift, burn out, and I just run it down the road and drifted it. So we're good now. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. You're gonna see go kart shit right now. It's a go kart shit. I need this motor on that one. Oh my god. Hell, that. We don't have a coupon for a hundred dollars. Goodbye, one. All right, guys. We'll catch you in the next one.